So there's this new video game person we're looking for. His name is Mr. Unlocky. Mr. Unlocky will do a couple cool things for us, but first of all, we need to go find him. In order to find him, we have to get to the first floor shop under a minute and 30 seconds. That shouldn't be too hard. I feel like a minute 30 is pretty easy, right? Technically, to unlock the Forgotten, you need to beat the first boss within one minute. So finding, the, you know, the first shop within a minute 30 should be pretty easy. We definitely don't need the bean here, so let's roll it and get a Sister Maggie moment. Epic. Is it in this direction? There you go. So in here, hello. There you go. There he is. There's Mr. Unlocky. You can see that he is a weasel. Is he a weasel? I don't know what he is. <laughs> But you can see that he needs money. We don't exactly have money, so let me bomb this donation machine. And donating a bit of cash moolah to this gentleman will give us a couple cool things. I don't know if he requires... Oh, I guess he, maybe he just needs one. Or maybe it's luck chance. But he pooted out this unlock key. The unlock key opens the door to boss rush and the hush floor regardless of the timer. So you can get hush and boss rush before 20 minutes and 30 minutes. And it allows the run to be continued past mother. It also increases the health of every enemy and boss by 20%. So it's actually kind of a pseudo hard mode when you uh, give Mr. Unlocky your stonks and bonds. So I wanted to try this out because this is super cool. It means that we're able to fight a lot of bosses uh, that we usually would not be able to fight, aka Mother, as well as always having access to some form of hush, right? On top of that, every single thing will have 20% more health. So it's going to be kind of a cooler, harder mode. Monster. Let's see if I notice a clear difference in his health. I immediately do. You guys gotta remember, even if I have base tears and damage, right? Sister Maggie does put in work. Don't ever sleep on Sister Mag. And this boss fight's taking a little longer than I was expecting. Usually by now, I'd be done. That doesn't seem like the biggest deal on Earth, but it could come into play the moment we decide to go to boss rush or something, right? And all those enemies will end up having 20% more health. Sacrum below us and Barbie to our right. Hello? Book of Revs. Yeah, we'll just use it. It's good to find. A world card for the rest of the floor. World's weirdest secret room. Maybe I can get the secret room with the tarot card? Epic! Nice, there you go. And I am given money and bombs. Perfect, let's go. We did find a judgment card. I'm curious if I want to reroll this in the secret room, right? We are going to need to power ourselves up a lot more than we're usually uh, expecting, right? Just because with enemies and bosses taking way more HP and uh, tears, we got to be careful. Blub. This is going to be completely off topic and kind of random, but I figure with the extra health Blub has, I have time to talk about this. Do you guys say Giffy or Jif? I feel like I always said GIF, but then people told me that's wrong and it's GIF. But deep down, like deep inside my soul, I'm still part of the GIF alliance. I can't tell really. Anyway, Blub's done. We're good. I don't actually have a key. I might never get a key. <laughs> I could get Bob's a key from this coin purse, please. No, okay. Maybe, luck up, no, and lemon party. Am I really not gonna be- hold on, let me find the super secret room. Oh, hold on, wait a second. You never know when you could just randomly get that certificate. Okay, that also counts. I'll take that, thank you for the key. It's very important that we buff ourselves up, right, with these extra enemies. Oh my god, the amount of luck I have. <laughs> A lucky penny too? It's very important that we buff ourselves up, right? We don't want to go into these extra- Like 20% more extra health on Mother sounds insane. I'm definitely gonna need some god items going forward. What was about in here? Well, reroll? Oh, so worth actually? Hold on. Okay, you know what? I'm I'm actually happy with those circumstances. The way that played out was pretty cool. And not to mention, we still have a judgment. You know, I could still do a reroll secret room uh, shenanigan here. I'm not gonna lie. I actually do find myself thinking that enemies are gonna die faster than they usually usually are, which is causing me to get overconfident and, and taking random damage. I'll take box, it's actually a really good item. Definitely not panic button though, not the golden version either. There's the bombs that Kiwi wanted earlier, that's okay. Let's take the judgment uh, and see maybe what's inside the shop over here. Hello. Oh yeah, I definitely want that voodoo head. Be right back. I just gotta, you know, I I, I gotta, you know, I gotta get my wallet. Sorry, I wasn't, I wasn't prepared. It do be downpour dose, right? So we have potential here for multiple rerolls. We basically have a double floor. What's in here? Uh, micro cell? I mean, giant cell. Wait, what? It's called giant cell? I must be insane. I always thought it was called micro cell because you get micro Isaacs. Uh, I, I don't really want it. Reroll moment. Take the blind? Hey, okay. We're going with the monster route today. Look at me and my little brother. <laughs> hello, Rainmaker. I have double of what I used to have. How do you feel about that? Goodbye, Rainmaker. And hello, tears up. Exactly what I asked for. Good stuff. Yeah, I'll enter the wooden wall. Plus, I get two cents. Thanks, dude. Wait, hold on. Don't forget, this is called character development. I can't believe it. Ladies and gentlemen, I remember to buy the shop item. Yeah. 
I saw some comments when I mentioned movies recently asking what my personal favorite movie was. So my favorite ever movie, ever ever, and it's because it's the only movie that's ever made me fully cry, is The Iron Giant. The ending to that movie is just like a masterpiece to me. Literally masterclass. Uh, Cursed Eye... I probably reroll here. Razor Blade, my god. <laughs> I can't exactly say I'm excited for that. I'm definitely happy about the speed up though, not the range up. That's actually range down with Monstrous Lung. I got instantly maze teleported to this treasure room. I will participate. I, I, 100%. Don't need friend finder. Well, maybe IRL, but we'll see. <laughs> I'm faced with a decision between reroll curse room, which would cost a heart every single time I want to do that, reroll treasure room, or reroll maybe potential angel room that's gonna happen. I feel like I want to do angel, I don't know, it, it feels like the incorrect decision, but the, the stakes are so high, you know what I mean? I can work with monster's lung, but I, I'm already seeing like how much extra health on bosses is affecting my uh, play style. I'm not used to it enough to play like that. And then again, you could say skill difference, 100%. But I think some extra DPS would definitely help me in that department. That helps. Oh my god, time to roll it into death certificate. Boom. Woo! Almost. <laughs> Is there a battery in here? There's a king baby in here. That'll get me conjoined. I can definitely afford it. A couple good sale items on the shop today. Both shops had had uh, 7 cent sales, which is really good, but I can't seem to figure out where the super secret room is. Hold on. Is it here? Is not. I have to save a bomb in case I fight the angel, huh? Okay, oh, oh, one second. Let me fight this 100% not Gideon. I, I don't think it can be Gideon, right? Because it's a tall room, but we're coming from the top. So it really would not work. It has to be Tough Twins. Hi, guys. Oh my god. Binding of Isaac Gaming for real, for real, on God? Let's go, dude. We get the angel. We get one of the best tears-ups in the game, in my opinion. Oh! This solves all of my issues. We take the key piece here for better angel chance, and then uh, let's use our reroll in the secret room. Wait, we're not gonna get a reroll! Uh, uh, what the hell am I talking about? <laughs> I got so excited, I was thinking for sure I was about to pull some god item like Sacred Orb. Ooh, you're getting very sleepy. Good morning, Isaac, you've been hypnotized. Now fight in the basement using your tears. This is not a dream. Cursed room with two pedestals? Okay, not even making this up. I've actually never seen this before. <laughs> I'm used to one. I'm used to there being a devil statue and there being one item. I'm used to there being red chests. Two items though? This one's unnatural for sure. Definitely will take it. Reroll? Oh my god. A, a literal god reroll. Hold the phone. I think I'll visit the treasure room and take the blind item, which is money equals power. This really says a lot about society, IMO. Perfectly timed rerolls. Well, more or less, I'm one over, right? But whatever. On top of a goat head I found on this floor is gonna be super nice. Hello, Hornful. You're not gonna live. I'm sorry. You are one of my favorite mines bosses. You grew on me, but I don't need you anymore. Interesting that King Baby makes it. Oh, I got a devil room. King Baby makes it so all your familiars home in on enemies, but the familiars do not home in on the dummies from Hornful. That's a nice touch, I like that. We get the Pact, we get Lusty Blood, those are just so incredibly good, all of them. I, uh, yeah, I'll take it. It is worth it. Oh! <laughs> There's no way I got away with not taking damage there. <laughs> I just got away with a murder. Uh, midnight snack. Let's just reroll this while we're doing these waves. Dead tooth is okay, but I'm not gonna be able to roll that again, so we'll just take it. Oh, it's right here. My bad. Oh my god, there's another secret room item? Whether or not I get, like, a, a chance to roll this, I suppose I don't really care, because sausage is just so good, right? It'll actually give us planetarium chance. That, coupled with our 8-ball we got later on, or I guess earlier on, depending on how time-space works, and your perception of it. There's nothing in here. Uh, we will probably get a planetarium. Yoink! Alright, let's go. Next floor. I have to remember, next floor, get the knife piece. And then this unlock key that we got really early on should let us go past mother which is really cool 22.9 percent planetarium chance that is an odd number i do not see very often can i compliment like the modders by the way for the the concept of mr unlock key giving you the unlock key <laughs> oh wow gubby's eye thank you i actually really i love that item secret room in here i'm done i can't believe it what kind of luck is this <laughs> Uh, wow, what? Are you joking me? There's two cents in here. I don't even care if that's a money beggar or a demon beggar. It's a money one, which is better. All right, I mean, like, at this point, the game's just giving me freebies. You guys, you got, uh, come on, like, come on, dude. I, oh, I imagine if that was a god reroll. It's almost there. Hold on, we just need a bit more. That does mean we'll have to take whatever I'm given here, and that is uh, the question mark item. Well, honestly, a quality four item, in my opinion. It kind of fell off during flash days, but I, I, I've uh, grown to like this item more. Milk? 
another roll. Oh! oh, yes! Thank you! Epic! Wait, hold on. I don't know how this works. What happens if you have goat head, you took a double deal, and then you take Eucharist after? Why do I not know this? <laughs> I guess I never came across this interaction? Really? I probably have, I'm just forgetting. Uh, I don't even think I can get a reroll, so it's not really important for me to ask. I don't know why I'm looking for secret rooms either. Oh yeah, okay, well, uh, that's to be expected, hi. Oh yeah, this splitting shot's going hard, dude. Especially with euthanasia, just constantly procking every now and then. Four luck is nothing to stop at. Stoff? Scoff. Not when you have uh, really good tier effects like euthanasia, right? Nice. We landed a devil deal. Of course we did. We have goat head. We get Krampo. Goodbye. We get head of Krampus. Uh, yeah, there's nothing I can do about that. Let me go to the wrap this knife piece. We were considering going to uh, Halloween Horror Nights and Universal recently, but I saw on TikTok, which I know I barely use TikTok, but for some reason I just felt like doing it for one time. I saw on TikTok that apparently it's like, it's really overcrowded for some reason. I wanted to go because I wanted to see FNAF at Freddy's, right? Five Nights at Freddy's. In real life. FNAF in real life. <laughs> But um, yeah, it's looking like that might not be the case. Whatever Isaac cosmic power there is in the world right now, in the universe, looking down upon me. Give me something good. Ah, uh, it's okay. Oh my god, it rolls in the stairway. Everyone shut up. Oh my god. I, I straight up did not know that. That's a really, really, really good thing to know. I've never known that about this spin down. What about in here? Steam sale isn't too useful, but it is pretty cool when it's summer and or winter and you just get a bunch of points on your level. Hey, Judgment. Uh, that's not too useful for me. I could get a HP up actually. Hold on. Never mind. You guys remember back? I, I don't remember when this was. I think back in like 2019. I think Steam had, you know, their basic summer sale, right? But they had like this weird glitch where you could farm gigabajillion Steam level on, on Steam. You know, the Steam level account, the thing that really just does not matter, but some people just go crazy with it. I remember that's how I got a bajillion levels on my Steam. That's weird to remember. I don't remember. Why was I even remembering that in the first place? Conjoined! Boom, stairway. Money equals power is sobbing in the corner right now. <laughs> Bro's gonna have no funds left after I'm done with this run. Heretic, super easy fight for us. Uh, walk out of the way of that fire. Give me you. I don't have a spin down, and it really would never have mattered. <laughs> I was gonna say, I was hoping it's not a good spin down. It's, I didn't even have an opportunity to have a spin down. Ba boom Well, that's okay. It doesn't even spin down into anything too crazy, right? Oh, that's right. I have Steam Sale. Never mind. I didn't need 30 cents. Uh, well, I guess I'll take the other key piece, right? Yeah, let, let, let's take the key piece for now, because I do think I have a potential to fight Mega Satan. And let's just move on. We'll take Sensor absolutely here. That's a TP. Very cool. We get Pentagram. Uh, this is just a must take in all regards. Oh, regards! Come on, baby. We already have Bookworm. It rolls into another spin down. Ah, <laughs> uh, if only, if only these were the days of Afterbirth Plus. What these kids don't know, dude. These kids just don't know. Devil's Crown? Pretty useless. No, thank you, though. Oh my god, hold on. What is this? Reverse hang ban. Do I want a double crown of light just to flex for fun? I kinda do, dude. That's kinda sick. Imagine rocking a double crown. Oh yeah! This is the greatest day of my life! I hope you know I came up with that joke when I was uh, looking around in Target for cat food. I don't really know why. Hey, that is pretty close to 2020, but there's just no way I can land a 2020, huh? I, sh I should check this out, right? Maybe oh, okay. Sorry, I, I didn't know I placed my bomb wrong. And toothpicks- Oh! I've never screamed so louder and so excitedly at a pair of sticks in my life. Give me here. Yes! These are the moments we live for. Get out of here, Visage. You're nothing to me. I have Gonga damage. I think it's more effective, right, for us to just buy this and then restock. Then maybe we can get a blue map, which would actually just give us the, you know, the spin down that we're looking for. Not like a multitude of spin downs. Oh my god, that's a habit. That's so close to Mutant Spider. Obviously, habit's the play here. Anything. We get a battery. Nada. That's okay. I mean, a habit is so broken. With the amount of health that I have, right, we're, we're gonna get every spin on I could possibly want. Okay. And when you give me opportunities like this, I mean, the world's your oyster, right? Why do people say that? <laughs> I'm asking the real questions here. The questions people are too afraid to ask. Who in the hell came up with the phrase, the world's your- Oh! Who in the hell came up with the phrase, the world's your oyster? I don't want my world to be an oyster. Oh, Azazel's rage 
guys, I'm going to go so hard on this demon beggar. Azazel's rage spins down in a twisted pair. Oh! Yes, dude, so good. And we still have Holy Light coming up. We did land a You Feel Blessed, so we can expect a probable angel room coming our way. Our HP is going to be pretty low doing this, but I'm, I'm not too worried, to be honest with you. We don't get any extra items. That's okay. I can't really ask for more. I landed so many good things in such a short period of time. Habit, Crown of Light, Sacred Heart, Brimstone, Twisted Pair is nothing to scoff at. I mean, obviously. Plus, we land a Holy Light. Epic. All right, let's go fight mom. And by fight mom, I mean, I'm gonna, she's gonna be on screen for about one second. Let's be real here. All right, mom, you got one second of screen time. Say what you want to say to your fans. Hi, honey, I love you. Ah! Uh, let's take negative because negative gives us damage. And as you can see, we can actually go fight boss rush. Let me be completely transparent. Uh, 45 minutes is typically past boss rush marker. So does that mean I can go in here, right? And then come back out and it'll still be open just because I have the unlock key. Very epic. I feel like I have to do this. Uh, Mom's eye is probably the coolest thing here. I think Isaac is such a unanimously like cool game, by the way. Like everyone considers it like the roguelike. Sometimes I'll watch an Alpha Red video and the thumbnail will literally be like something something roguelike. Oh my God, that's literally Godhead. Thank you. Oh my god, guys, using the power of friendship and love, I was able to achieve Godhead. Hi, is this mom's heart? Woohoo! Sometimes I'll be watching an Alpha Rad video, right? A and then the thumbnail will literally just be like a random PNG of Flash Isaac. <laughs> I just think it's the coolest thing ever that people are just like, oh yeah, that's, that's roguelike. I see that crying baby child on my screen. That means roguelike. I love that dude. Quick, someone get Alpha Rad on the phone. I need to tell him about putting Brimstone in the thumbnail. <laughs> This guy's going bye-bye. He's dead. I feel kind of bad, to be honest with you. Is it mainly because I got no gain out of that death? Yeah. Does that mean I'm morally incorrect? Because if I had gained something out of him dying, I would not have felt as bad. I don't really want to think about it too much. <laughs> I'll continue him? Say less, dude. Thank you. Oh, this is a TP. So many of these today. Voodoo Head is definitely putting in work. We land ourselves some pretty mid items that spin down into something pretty alright, to be fair. So, I guess I'll just take advantage. Uh, you, and then do I really even want- No, I don't want that dove. We'll just take the ghost bombs. We can actually destroy these spike balls, just because spike balls can always die to euthanasia. Same thing with the grimaces. That's probably why I like the euthanasia item so incredibly well. It's literally one of the only items in the game, that and what, like, uh, Little Horn, that can just take care of grimaces. No other item can do it, right? Oh, it's a scary boss! <laughs> Is this this turn in Revelation? It does. Hey, I learned that. We get nothing in here. Uh, am I really- No, wait, I have a mob challenge room. I can farm for Revelation. One second. Boom. And I'm not gonna make the same mistake I did. Let's just go. Another stairway, another trinity shield. Honestly, that's just a cool item to find. And I'll use this as an opportunity, probably the most casual start to a single angel room I've ever seen, by the way. Uh, I'll use this as an opportunity to get the second P piece that I already have. Well, Binding of Isaac mode activate. No need to stall here. Hello, mother. This should be pretty fast. <laughs> oh my god, what an absurd amount of damage I'm doing. Not to mention the holy lights. It's over? Now, the unlock key should make it so I can continue. It does. So you can actually just straight up end the run here, which is good to know. You can also go up, you can go down, or you can go fight Hush. And of course we're gonna go fight Hush, dude. I think that's a super cool idea, right? I understand the reason why, like, the paths- Oh! Wait, I can get soy milk. Yes? Are you kidding me? What is this build? I understand the reason, you know, that they created multiple paths that way, but I think, you know, if you have dead god or you just don't really care, because, I mean, who cares? No one's gonna judge you what you do in your own single-player video game, and you want to just speed up the process of unlocking, I think unlock key is a really balanced and cool way to do it, you know what I mean? Also, it has some flair and personality to it. Uh, Ouroboros makes this the craziest run I've ever seen. This is the type of run you get on the Matman build. Lazy Matman moment. Hello. Uh, we have conjoined already. So I guess I'll just take polydactyly. <laughs> sure. And then- Oh my god, you beautiful, beautiful boy. Guys, I found the actual perfect use for Samson's Chains. The one time Samson's Chains is actually useful is when you're trying to destroy Hush Rocks. Good stuff. Uh, we don't have a use for any of this, but I'll take it and I'll take a battery. And I think Hush is going to instantly die. This is going to be so good. I have to keep Ouroboros for him, by the way. I'm, and let's be real here. Like, what is going on? 
I think the Ouroboros just makes it way more fun. Like, look at this. This is just insane. Like, what is going on? Uh, I don't really know how I'm dodging, but I did it anyway. Very cool. I don't even know how much HP I have. I feel like I'm kind of low. I got tagged a couple times in that fight. Mainly because, uh, you know, I, I literally physically could not see. And, you know, my gamer instincts were not kicking in. So uh, Spidey Sense was not available during that fight. You know how it is. Oh, we're fine. What am I talking about? I'll just buy whatever you're selling. Wafer. We could use Joker right now. There's no way I'm going to get a deal, right? Yeah, you know what? Let's do it. Boom. Two heart deals. I feel like I just spin these down for fun, because why not? And just see what they turned into. What? It spin down into another double item? I wonder what that originally was. Huh. And we also get leprosy. Cool. You will not be living, Satan. I, I, you, I wonder if Satan gets tired of being beaten and like nonsensely, right? Like he's got to be like the god of the underworld. And yet every now and then, like every single day, a baby comes in who's just crying and demolishes him. So I think we take pop and crash our game, right? Like this is great. It's running beautifully. Isaac is a champion. He can handle any type of uh, synergies on your entire game. Add pop to the mix. It's completely over. Get ready to crash. Anti-gravity. Am I crazy for wanting to know what this does, dude? I mean, I could give up rubber. I got to. This seems like it would be so cool, right? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. What happened to my brimstone? <laughs> Am I just like, what? Excuse me? Do I need to let go? Oh, interesting. Lamb should be new, problemo. Goodbye. Bro, I actually survived. Just kidding. Never mind. Well, I think that's basically it. Let's see how much damage we ended up with. What a god run, and it's entirely because Mr. Unlocky is a complete homie. Thumbs up to that guy. Okay, it's alright. We're still not lagging, technically. You're gonna insta-die. I'm gonna set up a bunch right here. Right here, right up in your face. I'm sorry. It's gotta be like this. Goodbye! And it's over, dude. Alright, let's see. Big boy delirium? Big man? Big man! He wants to take me on. You don't want this smoke, dude. I bet you this is delirium. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, well, that, that's fair. I didn't really think so. Well, I'll, okay, I'll be real. I, I really did think so. <laughs> but, you know, sometimes life is just a bunch of 50-50s, right? Sometimes in life, the fact of the matter is, is that you're gonna get mixed. And you gotta take a 50-50. And uh, honestly, sometimes you're just gonna guess wrong. You're gonna have to take that L. And you will take 70% of your entire health bar and your drive gauge will die. And you'll cry. But that's just how it is. Oh, I bet you this is the gamer right here. There you are. See, all you gotta do is just take life as it is. Sometimes you're gonna get 50-50 and you're gonna guess wrong. And sometimes you're gonna guess right and you're just gonna diff the person. Life is about... I can't speak what's going on! <laughs> Life is about learning how to take those 50-50s and learning that sometimes you will just guess wrong and you are not him. And when you finally come to accept that you are guaranteed to guess wrong, then at that point, then you really are him. Anyway, uh, that was super awesome. I love the unlucky dude. Super cool. GG.